Okay, so here comes part two. Are you ready? I know you are. Um, and yes, I do know how to make cornbread. You don't have to tell me how, or dressing, you don't have to tell me how to do all the stuff. So, as you can see, I've got some um, cornbread already in here, and I've already put some crackers and some bread in here. But of course, I'm going to go step by step so that you know that I know how to make it. All of our nice little crackers, however, um, I got this big, huge box but they're all individually packaged, which is good for the long run, but <laughs> this is a pain in the rear. But the good thing is I can just squish them like this and then open the whole thing and pour it all in. It takes a few seconds here. Woo! Pour it all in, so we got that. That's good. And then, of course, the beautiful white bread. And I know you're gonna say, Cheryl, oh my gosh, you're using too much bread and too many crackers. I don't care, you're not here. I'm making it, not you. So, we're putting this in here, yummy, yummy, yummy goodness. Okay, and then we've got the chicken broth. I don't know if you can read that. Chicken broth, that's what that means in Spanish. So we're gonna pour that in there. The good thing is, mine's not hot like yours normally is. So, I'm gonna start off with that much. I also have the uh, nice, onions and celery. Probably too many, but I really like onions and celery, so I'm going to put that in there as well. That is pretty hot, though. Um, I'm going to scoop out the nice onions and celery. My, my uh, mixing bowl, as you can see, is a little bit small, but it's all good, because it's mostly just um, a bunch of bread in here right now, so we're all good. So we're going to start mixing that all up and then I'll probably add the rest of that as well. But, so this is my uh, second step here and I'll, um, I'll come back um, when I get all this nice and mixed and start adding the um, seasonings and then um, the taste test, which is the, the number one ultimate um, thing to do, of course, which is my personal favorite. And then, of course, I'll scoop some off to the side to eat before I actually cook it, which you hate me doing, but I actually love. So, love you guys, and um, yeah, I'll see you back in just a little while.